the question we try to answer is how can price indices be used to inform policy? So since 2016, our project has worked with Ghanaian authorities, particularly with the Ghana Statistical Service and the Ministry of Food and Agriculture, to help officials use the new price indices within their routine food price monitoring. There is government interest, but there's the need to support the creation of these new prices in terms of the data, in terms of computations, in terms of interpretations, and then the use. So to help introduce some of these new metrics, an informal nutritious food prices analysis support group is to be hosted at the University of Ghana's Institute for Statistical social and economic research, what we call ISE. Now, the idea is to allow government statistical offices to meet regularly with local economists and other stakeholders before and after the release of new data to discuss the significance and interpretation of each of the new indicators. We've gone very far, and hopefully we'll start our meetings from next month. Thank you very much. So. I'm going to call Derek to give us the conclusive implications of Candice's research. <laughs>